So Holly and I are just packing up uh, the car now and just as usual before a trip, it just feels like it's a mad rush to get everything packed. Does anyone else do that? They just feel like, yeah, and they don't actually feel like they've remembered everything. Anyway. All right, let's go. I think Elsie's looking pretty good, I have to admit. Might not take them just because they're Might not take the olives? Just because they're leaky. Do we need olives? No, that is a want, not a need. I think we're packed. All the camera gear. Now it's pretty packed in here, but they're gonna go upstairs when we open the tent, oh. and then these come out when we're camping. So, we've actually got a bit of room in here. Yeah. <laughs> This is our first trip since uh, we went up to Mackay in Queensland in 2019. Um, and we've been to a few places, but not, not a real proper, like a trip. So, exciting. In, in, in Elsie, the first time, first proper time. We've got pretty much all set up. Let's do it. I'll oh, just throw my air con on. <laughs> Woo. Rescue it. <laughs> Alright, we're just in Chuka. We're going to check out the old paddle steamers. And we just had a swim at the town pool because it was so hot. And then we're going to find camp. Geez, Elsie's looking good. Uh, so we just pulled over near the information centre here at Echuca. Um, just having a little rest and getting a few things done. Hey, Hull. Hey, how you going? Yeah, good. What are you doing there? Just doing some work, checking some emails, got to download some stuff. Um, yeah, just using the new... New thing? Oh, yeah, we're gonna... Tell you about this. So with sponsorship and like sponsored gear in this channel, there's a certain criteria it's got to meet. So one of them is if we already use the product, we already believe in it, and if they come forward, then it's obviously an easy choice. Two, if it's been on our radar. So, you know, something that I've done the research on or Holly likes the look of, and we do a bit of further research, we might contact them, and then they agree, jump on board. Third criteria is sometimes a company comes forward with a product I've never heard of, I've never seen, and they say, hey, we've got this, and we think it's gonna be useful for you and your audience because of this. A lot of the times, <laughs> it's just, you know. It's not. It's not. Uh, but one product uh, has come forward, so Netgear and Telstra came forward with sort of a internet solution for on the road. Now, a lot of people have asked us um, on the channel, what do you guys do for internet while you're traveling? And we haven't really ever had a solution beyond our phones. Mm. Um, so it's, on our big lap, we went through gigs and gigs of data, like, yeah. down, uploading stuff to YouTube. We'd always, you know, spend days at information centres or libraries. Maccas. Trying to use, <laughs> Maccas trying to use the free yeah. Wi-Fi. There was so. one time in Maccas we tried to upload a video for like three hours and yeah. it didn't upload. <laughs> so yeah, consistent internet is something that we need because we're running a business. Mm -hmm. Uh, online obviously just everything that goes with the channel but um, everything a little bit beyond that now we're doing a bit of freelance work so we need good internet so some people have asked us because a lot of people these days are jumping on the road and they have the opportunity to run their business while they're on the road and I think like why not like go for it if you have that opportunity to literally mm. make money while you're traveling um, I think it's such a good thing to do so the actual product itself, what is it? So this is the Netgear Nighthawk M5. So it's their new wireless router slash modem. Um, so essentially what this is, this is a, just like your, your router at home, it creates a Wi-Fi network, but the cool thing about this is it run, runs on a battery, so you can take it away from your home and you can put it, you can put a SIM in it. So mm. that means you can load it up with data and you're not locked in. And you're not locked in. You can go month to month or you can go a plan. Mm. It's on Telstra Network, which is obviously the best network in Australia. Uh, and it can pick up 5G. So, and it's got an awesome little information screen. It tells you how many days left you have, 
how many gigabytes you have so you're not going to be sort of caught out mm. um you know battery it's a little touch screen so it's a really nifty little unit so i'm, I'm thinking people with caravans mm. it's going to be awesome i would probably mount it somewhere in the caravan mm. and you could have your own wi-fi network in the caravan what i'm actually interested in uh in the future is it's got some uh external antenna inputs so i'm really keen to get one of those mounted on the roof rack and see what kind of extra range we can get because you're not going to get much beyond your sort of average uh, phone network although we are picking up mm. better signal on this than we are on our phones and Holly's on Telstra. Yeah. If you're looking for an internet solution on the road this could be it you know if you're traveling and you need like I mean you know a lot of people just watching Netflix these days um, while you're on the road nothing wrong with having good internet on the road no. you know. Um, keeping in contact with your family. Netgear Nighthawk M5, um, check it out. So we're just gonna get a little bit of work done and then we're gonna jump out to yeah, camp. And... We will have the link if you're interested uh, yeah. in our bio and stuff, so Yeah, check, check them out. out. And or in the description, sorry. Yeah, in the description below, check it out and uh, have a look for yourself if you need good internet mm. on the road. Could be a good option for you. What do you reckon? Oh, it's a pretty nice spot for the first night camp of the trip. So we're on the Murray, just out of Echuca. It's going to set up camp. Got enough room for the awning. Elsie River. This is as good as it gets, Hull. It's pretty good. We'll just see how the mozzies go. <laughs> yeah, well, at least we can get inside Elsie. Yeah. Trippy life. Hey everyone, it's great to be back on the road. Hope you really enjoyed this video. If you did, we'd really appreciate it if you gave it a like and a thumbs up and we'll see you in the next one. Cheers.